Hello there guys. Today I thought I'd go over some impressions of early Terra combat. From the standpoint of a melee class, in my case, the warrior. I'm around level 20 at this point and have a good set of 10 or so abilities. I think I'm hitting a level where dungeons are starting to be an option pretty soon, but for now I have just been going through the same old boring questing system. Kill X, collect Y. Somehow though, I have managed to keep myself pretty entertained based on two things really. The visuals to a limited degree, and of course the combat. Even at level 1, the combat is pretty fun. You have a basic attack and a roll. This game has collisions so you can't walk through anything, but you can manage to roll through them to get out of tricky situations. That roll that you have does take energy, and you may also have the option of spending that energy elsewhere, including blocking instead of dodging away, but you'll have some kind of way to avoid getting hit. From that basic combat of hitting the enemy and then dodging when needed, you get more and more abilities. These skills are interesting in themselves, and they are just meant to combo together really well. Certain abilities can only be used after others, certain things chain out really well with your dodge roll or with your basic attack. It gets more and more complex and fun as you go along. You start to learn which abilities to use in which situations. I can see PvP being really fun with all that in mind, although the only bit of PvP I've experienced so far is mindless ganking. But even just random mobs in PvE become cool to deal with. They have their own behaviors, charging forward, bouncing back, throwing things at you, I don't know, spinning around. Different behaviors that are dynamic and make combat in the game really fun. To beat those behaviors, you need to pay close attention to them and worry about your abilities as well as your positioning. I believe ranged classes actually have to aim, melee classes just have to be more in range and keep a good position as often you'll want to flank the enemy, often you'll want to hit him on the side, stuff like that. I can't speak too much to the range side of things anyway because I'm not playing one because it does play kind of like an FPS and I'm pretty terrible at them. But melee combat is insanely fun. As a warrior, I have some nice AoE attacks that I can chain together really nicely with my twin blades. I can go into defensive stance and block a lot and be more defensive obviously, or I can go in an offensive stance which will change my stats and the abilities I can use to be able to be more offensive and just deal a lot of damage. The warrior is described as being able to be either a tank or a sustained DPS which I'm really feeling at this point even though it is an early level. I already mentioned the fact that there is collision. That fact, as well as the positioning required to play properly, just gives a real feel to the game that I haven't had in any other MMO really. As I mentioned, the quality of the combat so far in this game is enough to carry it. I'm going to continue playing and hope it gets even better. I'm really curious how this action combat will work out properly in dungeons, raids, and endgame PvP. I haven't really looked into it too much in terms of online videos because I want to experience it myself. And you can do that too if you want, the game is completely free to play, so there's no reason not to give it a try. In the future I am going to be doing some more videos about Terra, probably some dungeon stuff, probably some stuff about the crafting system maybe, we'll see. For that as well as a variety of gaming content, you can subscribe to the channel. Otherwise, I've been Maple Dungeons, and I will see you next time.